We're gonna go over how to adjust the valves on the Yamaha YFM80. This will also be the same for the YFM100, which covers all 80cc Moto4 Badger, Raptor 80, and then the Yamaha 100cc Yamaha Champ. So you're gonna start off by putting it on top dead center. Just gonna need to remove this flywheel cover. It's normally got three bolts on it, screws. It's going to expose your flywheel. Your flywheel has these marks on it. The middle mark there will get lined up with this little bitty adjuster you can barely see in there. So you're gonna line. Let's see here, right there. That's your line. You line that up. It's gonna put your engine in the top dead center. Of course, with the engine and the chassis, you're gonna need to remove your carb intake that goes here. 24 millimeter is your valve cover. Yours is probably gonna be a lot harder to take off than that. You're gonna remove that. And you're going to expose your rocker arm and your valve spring. At that point, your nut here is a 5 16 You're going to need a 5 16 wrench. And then you're going to need a pair of pliers or something to grab the top of this stud here. So what you're going to do is you're going to loosen up that nut. And then you're gonna measure the space, let's see here, between that shaft and your valve. Just like, see, this one's actually a little tight. So Yamaha calls for three thousandths to five thousandths. I use four thousandths. So what you're gonna do with the engine cold, you're gonna turn the stud the center shaft until you can slide that that feeler gauge between the valve and the stud <clears throat> like so and normally you're gonna have two hands and it's not gonna be quite as difficulties that appears here. So see how that, that's a little snug. So we will loosen this up a little more and that's about right. You don't want it tight. You don't want it catching. At that point with two hands, you're going to hold the stud and then tighten down your nut. Of course with two hands holding them both at the same time. You're going to snug that up and you're going to recheck the space. And that one's pretty good. So you're going to snug that up, confirm it's all good. You're going to replace your valve cover. Of course, snug it up good. And then repeat on the exhaust valve. The engine in the chassis, I find the exhaust valve a lot easier. If you stand the chassis up on the back bar and then access it from the bottom which at that point is about chest height or you can lay underneath it and access it just as well but it's it's the exact same procedure but upside down there you go